Hello, my name is James Spiro and I'm here now in Tel Aviv celebrating the top 50 most promising startups coming out of Israel this year in 2024. I'm joined now by the number three spot, Exodigo, and its COO and strategy, Tamir Cohen. Tamir, hi. Hi, good evening. Thank you for having me. Thank you so much for taking the time. First of all, congratulations on the number three spot. It's Thank a huge you. accomplishment. So many great companies out there. For those of you, uh, for those of the folks at home who may not know what you do, tell us a bit about what you guys do. So Exotico was established, was founded in June 2021. And just like in three years, we are 200 employees and we are commercially deployed in the US, in Europe and in Israel. In Exotigo, we are helping every construction and infrastructure project all over the world to solve one of the most uh, biggest problems in any project, and it's to see underground. In this today's reality, one of the main causes for delays, for uh, incidents in every project are obstacles in the underground that no one knows where they are. So what we do, we take multi-sensing and AI, and we enable to see what's underground. Um, in brief, what we do, is we do an MRI, a CT scan, and an ultrasound to the underground, all in once. Wow, that sounds super efficient and exciting and needed. What are some of the things that are found when you do those scans and searches under the ground? It may sound like a silly question. I'm thinking of treasure. Um, but like, what are some of the things that you can, or mines? What are some of the things you should avoid or find when, you're, when you look down there? So first of all, this problem is common all over the world. It doesn't matter whether you do any project. It's common everywhere. And um, the main causes are you miss utilities. You don't find this electricity line. You don't know these communications, this water main, everything. Um, sinkholes, everything, every small utility that was not known in advance can cause huge delays. Um, it has a lot to do with what's happening with the environment and with a lot of people that are, uh, are around. Um, so every missed utilities causes delays in money. In, um, in safety issues, it's the same problem all over the world, and it's just a huge market. Wow, it sounds amazing. Um, tell me a bit about you guys and your team. You said you had you know, amazing growth over the three years that you guys have been around. So tell me about some of that journey in growing your team and, and building that company culture. So we just raised um, $105 million a round during these times, um, and during all of everything's going around, um, we doubled down on signing the deals and raising the round. And now this year for us is how we grow our team and how we deliver our projects that we signed. Um, it's very exciting. Um, we just grew in two years from 20, 30 employees to 200 people. Um, and we're scaling. We're excited about it. Just on a logistical scale, how do you manage that growth from such, you know, from relatively modest numbers to big numbers? I mean, you're growing from 30, 40 people to 200. How, how do you grow a culture and maintain that you so must have employees every week so first of all yeah we have a hiring curve and it's tough and one of the things that we are uh, emphasizing is first resilience how to separate the different geos and give independence in the great individuals that you bring into the company and the second thing we do not compromise compromise on hiring we hire and we source top talent a plus plus and in the end we believe in our people so we give them independence and we give them every space to create creativity and to take us forward to the next level. Okay, well, amazing. Tamir, that all sounds great. It sounds super inspiring. I'm honored to be sitting with the number three on the top, most top promising startups. Thank you so much for taking the time. Exodigo, number three, congratulations again. Thank you very much. Great. Thank you for having us and thank you for hosting this event, um, despite all. No problem at all. Thank you. Looking forward to seeing you next year and all the things you guys are doing. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers.